This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. In this lesson, we're going to configure limited administrators in Workgroup Manager. Let's start by looking at our directory administrator. The directory administrator account is set to administer the server and under privileges has full administration capabilities. We cannot change these settings because there has to be at least one directory administrator for our shared directory services domain. If we wanted to add somebody else who could perhaps manage just the contractors group, we can add them as a limited administrator. Let's choose Hugh. Under Hugh's account, under the Privileges tab, we're going to change his administration capabilities from None to Limited. When we click on the plus sign, we have the Users and Groups drawer that opens up. From there, we can select a group of, say, contractors for him to manage. In the lower part of the window, we see the four allowed operations that Hugh can manage users and groups with. In this case, I'm leaving all four of them selected. Let's test this out. To do so, I need to reconnect to my server, but this time, instead of using duradmin, I'm going to use Hugh. I know that I'm logged in as Hugh not just because I typed his name and password, but also when I look on this line, it says that I'm authenticated as Hugh to the directory. If you remember, Luke is the only member of the contractors group. We can verify this by going to the groups and looking at the members of the contractors group. This means that Hugh should be able to change Luke's password. So I'm going to highlight Luke, then I'm going to change the password. There were no error messages, so it should have worked. Let's try a user for which Hugh does not have permission to change the password. Note the error message because Hugh is not authorized to perform this operation. Setting up Hugh as a limited administrator is useful because now we can delegate some of our administrative tasks to other users.